Now, to find the length of a line segment, you have to remember the formula x1 minus x2 squared plus y1 minus y2 squared. And when you get that solution, you take the square root. And so if we say that a is x1, y1, then x1 is 4, y1, uh, y1 is 1. And if B is X2, Y2, then we can now sub in because X2 is negative 6, Y2 is 6. So we sub into our formula. So 4 minus and X2 is uh, negative 6. So it would be 4 minus negative 6 and we square that, plus y1 is 1 minus positive 6, and we square that. So what we end up then with is 4 minus uh, negative 6. Remember, add the opposite, so it becomes 10 squared plus negative 5 squared. And this is equal to the square root of 10 times uh, 10 squared is 100 plus negative 5 squared is positive 25. So this is equal to the square root of 125. Now, if a question asks you to give an exact answer, um, what you would do is the square root of 125. There is a perfect square here. 100. Uh, 125 uh, has a factor of 25, so we can write this as root 25 times root 5. And root 25 is 5 times root 5. And so if you're asked to give an exact solution, your answer would be 5 root 5. Um, but if you're asked to round to the nearest tenth, then what you can do is get your calculator and 125 square root is 11 point, and when you round to the nearest tenth, point 0.2. So this is equal to approximately 11.2, and it'll be units.